let's plot some points in the xy coordinate system. Now our coordinate system is made up of two different axes and the axes are just number lines. The first one is our x axis. That's the horizontal one. Notice zero is in the middle and then plus on the right, negative on the left. Really similarly, we've got our y axis. This one's just been tipped up on its side also with zero in the middle. Now where those two axes cross, we have the origin. This is the point where x is zero and y is zero. These axes divide our coordinate system up into four quadrants numbered just like you see here. Now let's get right into plotting some points. I'm going to start with this point 2 comma 4. Now these are listed alphabetically which is super helpful. The x coordinate is 2 and the y coordinate is is 4. So to plot this, I want to go ahead and find 2 on my x-axis, here it is, and then 4 on my y-axis, there it is, and I am going to match these up. I can line up the 2 and the 4, and I get this point here, and I can go ahead and label that one 2 comma 4. Next, let's plot this one, negative three comma one. So I know that negative three is my x coordinate, y is one, so let's line these up. So I'm gonna start by finding negative three on my x axis, there it is, and then I find one on my y axis, and I'm gonna line these two up, and that gives me the point, and I can label that negative three comma one. Next, let's plot zero comma negative two. Now I again have my x and y coordinate alphabetically listed. So I can go ahead and find zero on the x-axis and then negative two on the y-axis. This one ends up to be a point on the y-axis and it is this point right here. If I tried to line them up, that's exactly where I would land, zero comma negative two. I have a feeling that you are doing great so far. I've got one more that we'll do together, and then I've got some for you to do. This last one together is negative five, negative three, x and y coordinates. So I'm gonna start by finding negative five on my x axis, negative three on my y axis, and these two are going to line up at this point right here. And I'll go ahead and label negative five, negative three. These next few are for you to do. Go ahead and pause the video and come up with these points on the coordinate system. I have a feeling that you did really, really well. Check what you did against what I've got here on the coordinate system. You are doing fantastic. We're gonna tackle graphing lines next. Thanks for watching.